on a small campaign to save a park in Istanbul from demolition sparked nationwide anger against Erdogan, who is seen as being increasingly authoritarian. Fox Cat's Luke Schrager has more. The streets of Istanbul filled with protesters for a ninth day on Saturday as the city's mayor reached out to try and allay anger over the fate of a local park. There will be no shopping center or hotel in Gezi Park. During the last election campaign, Prime Minister Erdogan unveiled our project and people voted for us and showed their approval for our projects. At this point, however, the initial environmental issues have long been lost amid far more pressing worries for many ordinary Turks, worries that have spread far beyond Istanbul. This is not about trees. This is about the policies and dictatorship of the government. We're against these policies as young people. It's not only about the ruling AK party. This is about the system itself. Clashes have fled repeatedly since last week when police moved in to put down demonstrations. The heavy-handed tactics sparked a wave of criticism both at home and abroad. It led to many people questioning what they perceive as the ruling AK party's drift towards authoritarianism. Some even began demanding Prime Minister Recep Tayyip Erdogan step down and call early elections, something the party has now ruled out, with Erdogan himself maintaining a hard line against the demonstrations. Authorities have now offered to consult with protesters over Gezi Park's redevelopment, but protesters are adamant they want the project cancelled entirely.